welcome to my YouTube. I'm Jen. Today I am going to do basically a haul video, um, a little bit of an unboxing, but these are items that I purchased um, over the last month, month and a half um, from paperwishes.com. Um, not affiliated, not sponsored, although maybe I should be. Um, the reason I want to show you these is I feel like maybe I'm going to be using these a lot in my upcoming videos and I just wanted you to see um, everything all at once so you can see what I purchased um, and then maybe also give you an idea of their website. If you're not familiar with Paper Wishes, I've been purchasing from them for gosh years and years and years. They used to do monthly art subscription or subscription boxes, um, including a mixed media one. Uh, so I've done many of theirs, um, card making, things like that. Don't do the card making anymore. Um, I, well, I don't do any of their art subscriptions anymore because they actually stopped doing those. Um, but I still do purchase amazing items from them. Uh, this one was actually purchased, um, at the end of May in one of their sales. So Paper Wishes has these sales every single week. Um, so definitely check them out, paperwishes.com. They have, let's see, it's 50, 50 Fridays. So you get 50% off. Um, they have a one day deal on Thursdays where, um, it's kind of like a flash deal where they'll put up some stuff, um, some certain items, and then you have to purchase it that day in order to qualify, obviously. Um, they have $2 Tuesdays. Let me look real quick. So Monday Madness, um, find the latest and greatest products in their Monday Madness flash sale. Um, Tuesdays is $2 Tuesday. Uh, so you come back every Tuesday for your favorite products, only $2 each, Tuesday only. Wednesday is Wednesday Super Sale. Um, find the best products in the best collections, come back every Wednesday. Thursday is a one day deal. Friday is 50-50 Friday. Saturday is Super Sale Saturday. Um, find popular products in the best collections. Come back every Saturday for the best deals. So the reason what I'm going to show you is actually three separate orders, mainly because of how much I purchased, um, but also because these were all purchased on their sales. Um, this one, I want to say, um, was a one-day deal. Uh, I could be absolutely wrong, but each one of these were $5. Now, typically, um, they run, I want to say anywhere from $7.99 um, to $9.99 and sometimes even more. Um, and each one I purchased for $5. So let me show you these because these were the first ones that I purchased about a month ago. Um, these are what's called an artful card kit. And the intention is for you to create a card or a bunch of cards, obviously. Um, so it's got die cuts, um, cutouts, and custom papers. So this one's one of my favorites. This is the steampunk version. Um, and here are, let me look at this butterfly. How cool is that? Here are the papers. Uh, just to show you a couple, they are one-sided, so you never have to choose. You can use them all. Um, definitely coordinating. I am totally going to make a art journal page with these. Who knows, maybe I'll end up making cards, um, but typically I make art journals. And then here are the die cuts. So the die cuts are my favorite part um, at how intricate they are um, and just how pretty. Um, look at this, how cool is that? And then you get so many of them. This one has 61 die cuts. Look at that. And they're all pre-cut out. You might have to take your nail and just rub off that little nib right there just to make it go down um, from being attached to the paper. Uh, but that's it, that's the back piece. And then these are the cutouts. Oh, this is the back of the paper, but the back of the paper has the cutouts. Um, so there's 23 cutouts as well. So I'm not gonna show you every single one of them, but I will show you a couple of them. Um, just so you can get a good idea. I purchased, uh, well, they do a thing where if you purchase over $79, you get free shipping. Um, I ended up purchasing $85 worth on here, um, but my goal was that $79. So I purchased 
probably too many, um, but that's what happens. I prefer free shipping. And so, and that's why they do it. I get, I get why they do it. It's good marketing. Um, but I fall for it every time because I don't like paying whatever it is for shipping when I could be getting that in product. So, um, here is this pretty one. This is called Something Wonderful. And this one doesn't have as many die cuts. This one only has 39 die cuts. Um, seven coordinating papers and 25 cutout greetings. Um, so depending on how many you get, it would lower the price, the regular price. Um, here, everything is five dollars. Uh, this one is called Ooh La La. This is Paris themed. And this one has 74 die cuts. And remember, the die cuts are my favorite part. So. I mean, the papers are gorgeous, and I will absolutely use them, um, but the die cuts are really what I'm after. It'll be great to have a background for the die cuts, though. And this one I already took apart. I was just looking at it previously um, before I decided to make this video. Haven't created anything with them yet. Uh, just looking. <laughs> and then there's just that one. So there is the ooh la la. Um, and then you can see, I mean, Steampunk's my favorite, so of course I had to get a couple. So I got an extra one. Um, this one is called Espresso, and it has all of these pretty colors. Um, these are awesome for Steampunk as well. Uh, let me show you that one. I do want to make this a super long video, so I won't show you all of them, but just for an idea, here's the Espresso one. I love the colors um, and how the colors are so coordinating. It should make a really vintage, really pretty vintage tag or journal or junk journal or whatever. Card, birthday card, <laughs> if you do that. I love making birthday cards. I'm just horrible at sending them. Um, this one is called Daydream. This one is gorgeous, called Let It Shine. Gumdrop. Nice summer theme. A lemonade stand. Cider, so this one's very fall. Sugar Plum Foil. Um, so this is cool because it's got foiling um, on some of the pieces. It is Christmas, um, so there's that. I won't be using it for quite a while. I should have kept that in mind when I was purchasing them, but I didn't. I got excited. Um, I did keep that in mind for the next purchases. I didn't get anything Christmas, even though some of them could have coordinated very well with them. This is another one of my favorites, Playful Grace. It has some very pretty butterflies. Another Christmassy one. This one's called Wonderland. I've had this one in the past. Gingerbread foil. So I always love the foiling ones. Gorgeously gilded. Another foiled one. And a Cheer Up Buttercup, which is so pretty. I love the pinks and the blacks together. So that was my first purchase about a month, month and a half ago. And then shortly, a week or so after, I was so mad because it wasn't at the same time because I ended up getting so much, but I'm not mad about what I got. Um, again, $79 worth. I think I ended up going with $90 worth, but um, this was my next order. And again, I haven't touched any of it yet. Um, so my absolute favorite part, um, well, actually I love all of it. So I ended up getting a set. Um, it was like a one, I, it might've been a one day deal um, called Flight of the Butterflies. It was a collection. I purchased it for $61.99. I'll show you that in a second. But while I was purchasing that, I was trying to find more to get me to the $79. Um, and I've been eyeing this set from um, Stamp 
is it Stamperia, Stampera, um, for a while now. It's their SeaWorld set, and it is gorgeous. And I ended up, they only had a little bit in stock, um, but what they did have in stock, I went ahead and purchased. So these are rice papers. Um, so this one is the starfish. This one is like the schematics. Um, let's see. Maybe they just called it industrial. This one, I love. I absolutely love this. This is the seahorse. And I got two of those. Because I have a, a habit of saving the stuff I like the most. So I figured at least that way I would use one of them. Um, and these ones are the frames. Um, yeah, so I did get two of the frames as well. Um, mainly because I thought this would be the most useful because this size. It doesn't have the seahorse, but it seems to have everything else. So that's gorgeous. And then I got the papers. They didn't have the 6x6 or the 8x8 in stock, but they had the 12x12. So I purchased those and they are gorgeous. Sad part is they're front and back, um, so it makes me have to choose which ones I want to use. Um, happy part, nope, I think they're all different. I don't think any of them are duplicates. So I will be purchasing more, look at this, just so that I can use, and I love the rest on this, just so I can use all of the papers. Tags are cool too. Um, they may even be, oh, that's cool. So front and back seem to be in the exact same placement. Um, so that would be really cool when I cut them out, um, because then they'll be front and back sided and I can use both on that. Um, so there's your little submarine. Here's those frames again, only bigger. Look at how cool that jellyfish is. And it looks like the frames are the same way. So if I find a way when I cut these out to use them that size, um, maybe in a journal that size, um, and then I won't lose the back. Here's my favorite little seahorse. Gorgeous wood. My sister will love this little fish. It's a little angler fish. I think that's what's called. Um, And then here is what I was trying to purchase. Um, SeaWorld was super happy, happy accident. Um, definitely I wanna get more now though, um, at least the smaller sizes. This is called Flight of the Butterfly Collection. Um, and I got it for $61.99. I don't know if that's the normal day price. Um, I may have just bought it on a, on a limb without having any sales. So this is Flight of the Butterflies Platinum Edition adorable scorable paper um let me get rid of the sea world over here this is the and i'll open these up in a minute this is flight of the butterfly platinum edition luxury card collection so these are like the card toppers um it's also a door it's hunky dory uh adorable scorable look at how much is in this pack it is so much it is like bursting at the seams this is luxury card inserts contains 12 sheets um flight of the butterfly so coordinating obviously all these are flight of the butterfly gorgeous eight by eight paper pad it is double-sided and you get four of each design maybe at least two of each design three of each design And they are like photo quality. And I love these colors. Even this page, I love those greens. There's not one page in this whole book that I don't love. So. And that doesn't happen very often. Usually there's a couple pages you don't like, right? Um, so put that off to the side since we already looked at that. Next up we have the foiled acetate. Wait till I open that. That's going to be gorgeous. Um, and this just says debossed Mirai card. 
Um, so let's start with that. And it's definitely got it's got project ideas. Um, Hunky Dory is a company that Paper Wishes works with a lot, and they do videos. So you'll see product videos that they'll just be showing you, showing you stuff. But then they also show you what they created with it. Um, and then you can also see some videos of how they created it, things like that. So it's pretty cool. Um, so this again is the debossed Mirai card. Um, it's almost like a mirror. Looks like we had. Okay. So if you can see, hopefully I'm not blinding you. This is butterflies. That's pretty cool. I'm blinding myself, so I probably am blinding you, and I apologize. Just trying to show you how cool these are. So it does not look like there's any duplicates. It is one of each, but it is a big piece. So you should be able to use that pretty well. Um, this is the foiled acetates. So, and I haven't opened any of these yet. I decided to wait and open them with you. Um, so that we could see them together. Oh, how cool. Look at how pretty that is. And it looks like there is two of each here. Um, it says they're gold foiled, but that, that looks like silver. Silver foiled? Is that a thing? So, gorgeous, gorgeous. I think this side is the prettier. And then, of course, two of each. Um, let's see. There we go. How cool is that? So that was the acetate. Next we have, these are the inserts. So it just says Flight of the Butterfly, Platinum Edition, Luxury Card Inserts. Contains 12 sheets, one sheet of 12 designs. These are just regular paper. Maybe you write a little, write a little note, put it in your card, or use these to line the inside of your cards. Lots of options if you're making cards. I will definitely be using it for backgrounds. And I will probably try some of their suggestions um, turned into journal pages. So you'll be able to see that on my YouTube. I'm going to save this big one um, for last and show you these papers real quick. Apologize. This is a longer video than normal. Um, I just know people like to see um, see different hauls, different stores that they might not have purchased from in the past. So, this one is Flight of the Butterfly Platinum Edition Adorable so Scorable Selection. Contains 30 sheets, 10 colorways, three sheets in each. Um, so I do think this is more of the backgrounds for what we're going to see next. Um, and then there's three of each color. So they are glossy. They are thick cardstock. Um, one sided, the other side is white. This one actually is white. <laughs> Blue. Looks like we flipped over. Pink. Very pretty colors. Light blue. Another light blue. Oh. Another purplish blue and then like a greenish blue. So there are those. And now let's look at this because 
I've gotten hunky dory in the back in the past adorable squirrels and there's so many die cuts in here it is ridiculous um so this says eight foiled die cut topper sheets eight acetate folded cardstock eight printed cardstock four butterfly um eco concept cards four duo spinner concept cards and an inspiration sheet makes 24 cards or more if you use different pieces for different things there's five options um, there and then just look at this look at how intricate that is and you don't have to use them all on one you can split it up you can use different elements on different pieces believe love hope dream and joy same one so I have duplicates there these are just gorgeous I just love them these don't seem to be duplicates so it's just this one the blushing butterflies looks like I got two um, the other ones, I got one. So Butterfly, butterfly Blues, Mauve Moments, Delightfully Teal. Um, and then the coordinating cards to go with it. And then we've got some more little guys. This is called Special Bullert Birthday. I can't talk today. And Believe in You. You Mean the World and Birthday Wishes. So these are the cards um, that you cut out, so I will probably make those and just turn them into a junk journal um, where you can turn the pages, so double sided, gorgeous. I've got two of those, three of those, four of those, and then this one, ooh, this gorgeous purple promise. Seal treasure and I love the way the colors coordinate pretty and pink true blue more cards two of each gorgeous gorgeous I love butterflies. I recently got a bunch of butterfly die cuts, so I'm super excited to make something with all of this. Um, and then there's this. I'm not sure what it is. It says, Wind Beneath My Wings. Butterflies down here. Um, here are some card bases. Or card envelopes, I guess. Card envelopes. Um, and then here's the inspiration card. So you've got a butterfly eco card. And it shows you how to put that together, and that's what these are for to actually do the layers, so that's pretty cool. Uh, the duo spinner was the other one. Um, so there you have it. Oh, oof, look at all of that inspiration! Love it. Okay, and now today, the reason I decided to make this video was um, just a couple days ago, it came super, super fast. Um, there was a sale. It was a $2 Tuesday, so today's Friday. I ordered this on Tuesday, um, and it is already here. Um, so $2 Tuesday, and they had these on sale, not for $2, for $1.50 each. And these are die cuts, but they are um, uh, dimensional. So sorry, I had to take out my packing ship that has my address on it. Um, they're dimensional so that you can add 3D effects and this box is heavy and I once again added one of everything to my cart. I did take out a couple of the Christmas ones because I thought about it um, and then I added duplicates of a couple because I had to get $79. So this one I got my $79. 
in fact, $79.20 when it was all said and done. So, a um, couple in here that were just cute, and then there is definitely some steampunky ones in here that I'm excited for. So, these are cool because you go by the numbers and you layer them. This is oh, something similar. It is one of them from one of their kits. I don't know if it's one that I purchased, um, but it is a clock, and if you can look at that dimension, um, and you just literally do one piece on top of the other. You don't have to, you can use it as is. Um, like that cock clock face, it has the same piece underneath it. Um, so you don't lose anything, you just gain a lot of dimension if you do it that way. So anyways, um, Evanstown, gorgeous foil on this one. I love this. This one's called Picket Fence. I'm shocked that it's not wrapped, but because I did literally just open this, but um, look at how gorgeous that is. Botanicals I did buy apparently three of um, because that's one of my favorites. I'm thinking Picket Fence is becoming one of my favorites. Look at how pretty that is. Um, songbirds. Nature's Touch is another one of my favorites because of the butterflies. So I got three of those as well. Um, this one's one of my favorites. This is their steampunk one. Um, I love the butterfly. Um, and the hot air balloon. So, remember, these were $1.50 each on a $2 Tuesday. So, um, magical music. Music notes. Vintage Journey 3D Pyramid. I've never used this one before. Although I have something pretty similar. Um, I have these um, little vintage tickets um, that I think might be something like this. But this is a new one I've never seen. Oh, and this one actually has two. Um, so that's pretty cool. Some of them looks like they have extra pages behind. Um, so this one probably would have been one of the more expensive ones. Um, Garden of Posies. Robin's Whimsy. Um, good life greetings. Hopscotch. Look at how cute that elephant is. I love that. Mystic feathers. Honeysuckle. Sunny medallions. This one has two. Stolen moments. Oh, look very good on a vintage card. Um, Florals for colors. Kindred spirits. The sweet life. White truffles, one of my favorites. Look at that. Trailblazer. Um, not sure about the deer um, being mounted, but other than that, it's super cute. Paper flowers. Family ties. Look at that family tree. How pretty is that? North Country. Geometrics. Picture perfect. Strawberry jam. Homegrown flowers. Serenity. Majestic Mirage. That is pretty. Homeward Bound. Apparently three Homeward Bound. I really liked the hot air balloon on that one. Confetti Play was another one of my favorites. Um, love the tree. I got two of that. And then these ones are even bigger. Also $1.50. Uh, painted Flowers. And these are just die cuts. So um, these don't seem to be, although you can layer them and definitely use them um, as all together. Um, yeah, there's 64 die cuts in here. So... Um, slightly different than the 3D, 3D paper toll. Sorry for the noise. Um, but still super cool. So, 
you know I love my die cuts so looks like there's actually two pages and I got a couple of them so I have plenty of those white truffle you saw the little one before um, yeah I think or we've seen white truffle before so this will go great with it um, fresh cut this one on that one hopscotch and I think I got two of this one. Nope, just one. Robin's Red. Dark Room. I love this one. And Rhapsody. And I really like the colors on that one too. So I know that was a lot. Um, it was over a month and a half, roughly. Um, and probably $79 each order, uh, maybe 90 So, um, all in all, about probably $250 between all of that. But I'm super excited to start using it. And I definitely spread it out over three paychecks, so that helps. Um, let me know what you think in the comments below. I will put their link down there, but remember, not affiliated, um, not sponsored, anything like that. So don't feel obligated to do anything there. Uh, but definitely take a look, because I love Paper Wishes. Um, I love their products. They're dazzles. Check out their dazzles because they're gorgeous, gorgeous stickers. Um, they're like vinyl stickers um, that I, I absolutely love. So anyways, <laughs> take a look. Let me know what you think. And as always, thanks for watching. I will definitely be creating. Um, I'll just be posting them in a separate, a separate video for you. So time to create. Mm -hmm.